I have a bit of a pendulum between um, yeah, imposter syndrome, I'm like <laughs> way too deep here and I don't know what I'm talking about, and just being generally very inspired and ready to take on the world and and getting a lot of fo- positive feedback I have. I don't know if it is by design, but I have a community of people that are consistently pushing me forward and seeing the light of what we're doing and being very motivated to do things themselves um, through the work that we've been doing. Um, Yeah, and just a lot of really positive things spring out of our work, which has been, yeah, feeling very blessed to to have had that opportunity and that responsibility. Mm. Um, And also now being a place of knowing, it's not, not feeling scared at all, you know, give me, Give me a goal with regards to restoration and activating people, and you know if there's if there's a way, we will do it. It's yeah. Not impossible. Yeah. And uh, I, I've had quite a lot of really apex moments in my life, which has seen me marching up hills with a thousand people, and coordinating an effort to plant ten thousand trees over one planting event. You know, in a matter of hours, mm. and that in itself really gives me a lot of hope for what's possible with regards to restoring functionality to climate systems and ecosystems mm-hmm. um, and bringing the hydrological cycle back into balance and you know we that for me is what's most important here and I, every time people do that it restores one's own humanity it brings it brings the humanity back to oneself yeah. based on the fact that you're doing something selfless and in col- collaboration, community. And uh, I think there's just also a lot of really good microfungus in the soil that kickstarts your immune system and your happiness systems and you know, get, yeah. gets you into the right headspace. <laughs> and, uh, allows you to value the things that are important. That's it. I, I, I totally agree. I think you realize the actual true values of life, don't you? 